Hello, my name is Mike Geig, and welcome to part six on my video series on Windows programming with C Sharp. Uh, part six is our code integration in dialogues chapter. Uh, I like to call this my, my little bit of everything chapter because that's essentially what it is. We're going to start pulling in the different components that we've seen and kind of expanding upon some different practices and stuff. In this part, we're going to talk about uh, events uh, more in depth. We've used events so far, but we're going to take it a step further and kind of look at the anatomy of events and how everything works. Uh, we're going to look at dialogues. Uh, and uh, if you're not familiar with what dialogues are, you'll get to see those. Uh, we're going to talk about having multiple forms in a single application and a great way to transition between those forms gracefully. And we're going to talk about creating our own controls dynamically. Uh, what I mean by that is in code. Uh, so far, we've just drag and dropped controls onto the screen uh, before we've run the program, but we're going to look at creating and placing controls when we run the program. Uh, and so, uh, so with that, uh, let's get to it. Welcome to part six.